or no Camino, it's Pastor Bruce. Uh, this has been VBS week, and I've been hanging out with the kids this week, and you get a little sense of the stage. And um, Wednesday, uh, I was helping out with some of the music and, and the kids, and of course they were up here on stage going crazy. And so we got to see all of the kids, and uh, they're all different, right? We got like 75 kids, all the way from three, year, three years old, all the way up to uh, fifth grade. And uh, so it's just been, it's been a lot of fun. Kids have been crazy, having fun. We're looking forward to the program uh, Friday night, right? The program's going to be, and kids are going to come up, and parents are going to get to see everything. It reminded me, those of you who've worked VBS before, your kids surely uh, went through VBS. Um, they're all different, right? Kids are different, and you never know what you're going to get, right? They come in, and, and you see them the way they are now, and, and um, but down the road, you don't know what God's going to do in their lives. And the way they are obviously now, and the way they're going to be in another 10, 15 years, who knows what God's going to do in their lives. I was thinking about uh, Luke chapter 15, which is the uh, parable, the prodigal son. And, uh, you know, life goes on and the story goes. And, and uh, the one son decided that, well, he wasn't happy with the way things were. And he wanted to get his um, money, his inheritance. And he was just going to run off and do his own thing. And the story, and you know the story, the story ends up with obviously things going poorly uh, for him. And he comes back with nothing. And the text actually says that as the son is returning that his father sees him coming from a long ways off. Oh, obviously, the father has been longing for him, looking for him, waiting for him, and on a regular basis because he's out there standing as the sun comes up. You never quite know, do you, what God's going to do in people's lives, in your children's lives, your grandkids' lives. You don't know. But the love that we have for them, that which makes us pursue them, pray for them, hope for them, encourage them along the way. That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing as a church. It's what you do as parents and grandparents. Uh, you continue to believe that God has great things in store for them. And you pray that they will follow Christ. Um, that's why we do it. Thanks for all your support. Uh, this coming Sunday's Father's Day. We're going to talk about it. See you soon. Bye.